Good morning, it's James here. I'm on a uh, small farm in Gloucestershire. We're looking uh, at the BPS and uh, just making sure everything's uh, done correctly as far as cross compliance is concerned. Um, on this farm, we've uh, planted cricket bat willows. Um, you can see them behind me actually. We've done uh, there's a couple of hundred in here now, and these uh, willows are coming up about four or five years old now. Um, looking really, really good actually. Let's have a look at this one over here. Uh, be careful because I'm right next to a river. I don't want to fall in the river. That'd be entertaining for you. Uh, let's turn this around. So, cricket bat willows, four or five years old, doing really, really well. Uh, what we need to do every year, I don't know if you can see this, just there, there's little uh, water shoots, little shoots. And at this time of year, they're nice and floppy and tiny. We just go flip them off like that. And just, it's called bark rubbing and just rub them off like that and that prevents knots from appearing in the in the wood um, and makes the cricket bats nice and uh, well, perfect really um, so that's a little job a little job for early spring is to go around all your cricket bat willows and uh, knock the uh, knock the little buds off so there we go, nice clean tree. That's clear up to ooh, about four meters at the moment. Um, and uh, looking around, he's got to do, uh, do all the rest now. So uh, there we go, cricket bat willows. Great investment, um, could be a pension pot. Well worth uh, planting on wet corners. And we can still graze underneath them, which is the important thing. So you can still claim your BPS as long as it's here. Uh, claim your BPS underneath those. And uh, it's a good winner all around.